Janet. Welcome to We're Gonna Make It, Simple Crafts for Complicated Times. I'm a youth services librarian at the Wilmette Public Library, but I'm not at the library today. I'm at home in quarantine. It's okay, we're all healthy now. I just have to stay home for a few more days. I'm guessing this is going to happen to most of us at some point this winter. For whatever reason you have to quarantine, it's important to be ready. You need your food, you need toilet paper, and most importantly, you need craft supplies. This episode of We're Gonna Make It is going to be a little bit different. Usually I'm all about using what you have at home to make stuff and not going out to buy anything. Not this time. We're also not going to actually make anything. Instead, I'm going to suggest some craft supplies to have on hand in case you find yourself stuck at home and unable to leave. In case of quarantine, You'll want to be able to keep yourself busy and engaged. You'll want to have a versatile supply of craft basics. Here is what I suggest. A big box. Now, I think we all know that boxes have a lot of uses. Your box can be your project. You can build something with your box. Or you can just use the cardboard for parts of other craft projects. And then you need a box within the box. This is where the good stuff really is. So in my box, I have some fresh markers and fresh colored pencils. I've also got a new pack of construction paper and white plain printer paper. Then I've got adhesive, a glue stick, some craft glue, and three kinds of tape. Masking tape, painter's tape, and scotch tape. After that, I've got a couple cardboard tubes, some pipe cleaners, you can do almost anything with pipe cleaners, yarn, and popsicle sticks. I think I can do a lot of things with just those supplies. Now, if you have a special hobby, like knitting, maybe you would like to have some new cool yarn in your box. Or if you're a painter, some new paints. I also think it's nice to have something kind of random and surprising. I have embroidery floss. I'm going to see if I can remember how to make friendship bracelets. Maybe you could have some glitter or some bubble wrap, just something to Mix it up a little bit. So what do you think you could make with all of these supplies? What would be in your box? Once you have prepared your emergency quarantine craft box, stick it in the back of your closet and forget about it. Don't open it until you are quarantined or you've been vaccinated. If you have time and extra craft supplies on hand, make a mini emergency quarantine craft box for a friend. Deliver it when they're stuck inside. Let's face it, quarantining is not fun, but it's a necessary part of pandemic life. So long as we're stuck in this pandemic, let's try to make quarantining slightly less unfun. Let's try to be ready and keep our minds and our hands busy. And that is how we're gonna make it.